What is up ladies and gentlemen, this is Jeff Benjamin with iDownload Blog, and I'm gonna do something that normally we don't do. I'm gonna show you how to jailbreak the iOS 7.1 Beta 3 using a modified version of Evasion. Now if you that raises any red, red flags for you, feel free not to follow this tutorial, but if you are running iOS 7.1 Beta 3 and you wanna jailbreak it, you can follow this tutorial. So this is the modified version of Evasion. I have my iPod Touch fifth generation hooked up. It is running, of course, as you saw in the initial uh, outset of this video, it is running iOS 7.1 beta three, and I've sped up evasion just to get through this as quickly as possible. And just so you can see that indeed, yes, it, indeed it does work. Now, if you try to run the non-modified version of evasion uh, that you download from evasion, Com. If you try to run that with the uh, 7.1 beta 3, you'll get an error message when you plug in uh, your iPhone or your iPod touch or whatever device you're running. You'll get an error message saying that Evasion is not compatible. So you will need to download, download this modified version of Evasion. Now the likelihood of the evaders officially releasing an updated version of Evasion 7 to accommodate the 7.1 beta 3 is very, very minimal, very unlikely in fact. And that's the reason why we decided to go ahead and show you this video with the modified version of Evasion, just to show you how it does work and how you can indeed jailbreak your iOS 7.1 beta 3 device using the modified version of Evasion. Now, again, if you don't feel comfortable doing this, that's completely understandable. I understand why you wouldn't want to do that um, because it could, you know, possibly, I guess, technically it could be malicious. It could have malicious content inside of it. It could be modified that to not, uh, you know, who knows what it could, what it could do. But I've tested this out and I haven't had any problems with it. So I'll just say that. So the jailbreak is almost completed here. It is finishing up, coming to a close, and then we should eventually get back to our lock screen. And here's a lock screen. I'll just unlock. It takes a little while. Sometimes it lags up on that final unlock. And I'll swipe over and there is Cydia. We'll load up Cydia. And per the norm, it's preparing file system and getting everything in order, all the cards in order for Cydia to start working. And once that is completed, it will respring and then you will be able to launch Cydia again. And then you'll be able to select your user type and such and such and so on and so on. So now we are back at our lock screen. Cydia has finished preparing file system. We'll launch Cydia again. And there it, are. there it is. Who are you? I'll hit done. Now I'm not connected to the internet on this iPod Touch 5th generation running iOS 7.1 beta 3. But you see, you get the point, it works, and you can jailbreak your device just that easy. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.